everyone, it's Angela Schuster from Faux Time Design. Uh, hey, welcome, it's Friday, can you believe it? It's Friday, um, and we hear there may be snow on the way to New Jersey, go figure, um, but hopefully not. Anyway, we're coming to you live from one of our job sites. Uh, we've made some tremendous progress, and I just kinda wanted to give you uh, a little insight uh, where we are. Um, so, we are actually now down the hallway in the client's office. We have been working again on this beautiful molding. We are creating a faux bois finish, uh, which for those of you who uh, may remember from last week, that is a wood grain finish. You can see this gorgeous built-in behind me that we're matching, and again, uh, fabulous. Ellen is right behind me and doing what she does best, which is pretty much everything. So um, she's actually working on adding the heart grain. I'm gonna turn it around so you can actually watch and uh, I'll give you a little insight into this. So, all right, Ellen, you're the star. So there you go. So she is adding in um, the heart grain right now. This is a very detailed pro uh, process. We take a very fluid uh, glaze and we tint it um, so that it will match some of the undertones in the actual wood. You can see the wood over here. Um, and then we will come in with several toning layers to get it to match exactly. So, great job. As always, Ellen, you are fabulous. So I'm gonna walk in and show you, uh, we've actually made uh, quite a lot of progress in the great room. So I wanna show you that. All right, we'll see you later, Ellen. So before we get to the great room, I actually want to stop in and show you in the powder room what we're doing here. So the client decided she wanted to kind of push the envelope and really exciting because she decided to take a little art deco uh, approach here. Um, really exciting. So you can see a uh, fabulous Abby. <laughs> awesome Abby is over my shoulder. So um, we actually designed a really unique um, pattern that is going in the molding here. So what we did was we actually used the tile as an inspiration. And I'm gonna show you the tile. Let me flip down here. So you can see the tile work here, really beautiful, all right? And then our homeowner decided to kind of take the plunge and uh, she did all of the molding, the crown molding, all the panels in a deep black, along with the ceiling. You can see the ceiling here. Really gorgeous, really fantastic. We're gonna be doing another finish on the walls that will coordinate with all of this. But right now, Abby is working on the pattern, which has some beautiful champagne and silver tones to it, as well as one of the products we like to use is Metropolis Metal Light, which gives it a little bling. So uh, it'll kind of catch that light that you kind of see projecting now. So you ready to pull? Yep. Nice. All right. Yep. All right, okay. she's ready. She's gonna show. Okay, drum roll. <laughs> okay. All right, here she goes. This is actually, guys, uh, this is called a negative stencil application rather than a positive. So here we go. <laughs> and of course, that's, there we go. Hey, ta-da, that looks fabulous. Yay. Good job, yay, excellent. All right, so she has these three. Let me see if I can move out of the way. All right, she has these three and a lot more to go. Yeah. <laughs> and then she's gonna be detailing them all out. Um, really exciting. Great job, Abby. All right, so let me show you um, what we're doing in here. The great room is just about finished. Uh, I see lovely Lauren over here. So let me uh, show you what she's working on. So as you know, we have been working in this enormous, great room okay um let me actually take you over here before we say hi to to lauren so as you might remember from last week we worked on this beautiful copper ceiling let me actually reverse it here so there you go beautiful so we did this gorgeous copper leaf ceiling and um i don't know if we had the tape pulled last week so it's kind of good to see where the light projects on it, absolutely stunning. And then we actually worked on this distressed plaster finish all along the walls. And our final piece in this room is we have been creating this faux bois finish on all of the molding. Hi, Lauren, now you're on. <laughs> 
and our goal is to match it exactly with this gorgeous built-in we have over here. Now, let me get you close up so you can see. The ladies applied the wood grain, and then we actually went over with adding in the heart grain, and you can actually see it is incredible. The outside of the panels still have two toning layers, but it is, as you can see, matching up exactly to the beautiful wood that is going on here. So let's walk over here so we can get a little close up and show you a little more work that lovely Lauren is doing. All right, Lauren, you're adding in one of the toning layers. Mm -hmm. So there you go. So you can see this adds in like a burnt sienna tone to it, which will match exactly with the wood grain. Let me get a little close up here. And as she adds that, then she will take her badger brush, you can see it's in her left hand, and then she will soften it um, again. Oh, <laughs> uh, <laughs> great job. <laughs> oh, goodness, we have way too much fun here at Photo Time Design. So anyway, um, great job, great job. So all right, folks, I just want to wish you all a very happy Friday, and uh, we will see you next week. Um, for those of you who uh, are watching us on our Facebook and Instagram, we have some exciting news coming out this weekend as we are going to be announcing some professional classes at the uh, studio coming up in the next few months. Um, we also have some very uh, exciting do-it-yourself class curriculums that we've announced. So uh, jump on our website and have a lot of fun, but more important, enjoy your Friday uh, TGIF. So there you go. Thanks so much, folks. Talk to you later. Bye-bye.